What's good, YT? I'm going to share with you what I will be cooking. Something real simple, but um, I just wanted to come and share with you guys. I got some old-fashioned oats. Basically, I'm making peaches and cream oatmeal, but I wanted to make it myself. So I'm going to come and share what I... I'm going to be doing I got um a cup of water already boiling on the stove I didn't add any salt with it I just want the water I don't want no salt with it and I'm add a half a cup of the oats and I'm going to eyeball it I love peaches so this is why I love peaches and cream um oatmeal and I got this from the Dollar Tree oh lord how long ago probably like um, just before Thanksgiving, I believe. So, yeah. Mm. And this says, um, 100% fruit juice. So, I won't be using any sugar. I'm undecided. I'm going to taste it and see. And if I need sugar, I'm going to use, um, some brown sugar. And I got this container from the Dollar Tree as well. And it's really good quality. I wish I would have got more, but you know how that is. You snooze, you lose with the Dollar Tree. So for my cream, I will be using my International Delight Cinnabon cinnamon roll flavor. If you don't have that, you could use heavy cream. You can use um, almond milk of your choice. You can use carnation milk, or you can use a little bit of condensed milk, but you basically want to put some type of form of cream in your oatmeal. All right, so, yeah. Let me open my peaches. For those of you that have been commenting on my videos and telling me all types of good things that you like that I'm doing, you guys, please know I so appreciate you for that. Seriously, you don't know it means a great deal to me. I don't, I don't take anything for granted. Whether I get 15 views or 80 views and three comments, five thumbs up, however much it is, I'm grateful <laughs> because that means one person out there somewhere is watching me or they're liking something that I'm doing. All right, y'all, so I'm running my mouth. I'm going to take some peaches and put it in my um, blender. Try not to make a mess here. I'm so tempted to eat one, but I'm not going to. All right, you guys. I say that should be enough. And I want the flavor, the peach flavor, really intense. And this is, I just taste the scent when I um, lick the floor, fork, and it's not overly sweet. Okay. Let me go ahead and put my oatmeal in the pan. Oh, wow, I've never seen a container like this before. Let me show you guys. It usually has the um, silver, you know, pull brim thing on it. I don't know what I mean. So I'm gonna add my um, oatmeal to the pan. And give it a stir. Find me a little soup. We're going to roll with her today. That curry stained my spoon up. <laughs> yeah. Turn my fire up a little bit more. All right. I'm going to add some cream. And we're going to put the top on it. Mm. 
make sure I got it on tight, you guys, because one time I was doing a smoothie war video, y'all thought I was doing something and didn't have to talk on tight, a hot mess, yeah, that's it, that quick. If y'all can see how good this smell, it probably look nasty, but it smells so good. So I'm just going to take that and pour it in my oatmeal. Y'all see how creamy that is? It's cold out here. Oh, we. It's been snowing since this morning. And it's 9.30 in the evening. Today is Monday, February 8th. Oh, that smells so good. Oh, I'm all looking but not in frame. Whoop! I got one piece I didn't mesh up too good. But that's okay. So it is cooking and it's smelling amazing. I'm going to add some cinnamon to it. Mm -mm -mm. Smell like some peach cobbler up in here, y'all. Mm -mm And if anybody tries to make this, you don't have to use peaches. You can use strawberries, blueberries, cranberries, apples. I like to make this with bananas. Um, my second favorite oatmeal besides the peaches is bananas. Perfect for a cold morning before you send the children to school. Or even when they come home from school, you want to give them a quick snack. To fill them up and hold them over to dinner just long enough to get their homework done. Because that's not good, doing homework on an empty stomach. Or better yet, going to school. Inexpensive, but yet so fulfilling. So I'm going to go ahead and turn it off. Because it's sticking. I'm not going to add no um, water to it. Or any cream. Um, I look like my bowl's dirty. Had to rinse my bowl out. It's about as old as Jerusalem. But I'm going to try to do this with my hand. But let me just... If you're new to my channel, to my new subscribers, welcome aboard. Thank you so much for subbing. Uh, put, let you know your girl's super clumsy. So you'll see me dropping stuff, stuttering, butchering up words, but that's me. Uh. Mm -mm -mm. 
Okay. Now, why I didn't add any sugar? Because I am going to top with this. And I freeze this. I can get it open. I took the um, plastic off of it. Want to shirt there? It's almost like ice cream. <laughs> All right, there we go. I was gonna um charade some chocolates, but I thought I had dark chocolate because it's late in the evening and I needed dark chocolate for the slave. So I'm just gonna sprinkle a little love. Oh, you guys, I just realized something. I didn't add a lick of butter to it, but I'm going to taste it and see how it tastes. Um, my butter choice is going to be the Smart Balance. I have butter in there, but again, like I said, it's late in the evening, so yeah. I hope you all enjoyed this video. If you did, put one in the air. If you're not familiar with one in the air, that's a thumbs up. All right, and if you try this with any other type of fruit and you like this, let me know. All right, y'all stay beautiful as always. Keep it sexy. Toodles, y'all.